This is Master Use, <clears throat> and I want to report that Texas is again trying to make it illegal to film or photograph a police officer. That's right. I just believe it's Jason Villavo. He's a, uh, believe, a Republican out of Dallas. Uh, you can find more information. The, uh, hold on one second here. It's House Bill 2918. Jason Villaball. I may not be pronouncing that correctly. Is trying to make it a crime. If you take a picture of a police officer or a photograph or a video within 25 feet, you're committing a crime. This is another house in run to try to make photography of officers, law enforcement, who are committing crimes illegal. It gives law enforcement officers who have done something wrong the right to arrest you because you photographed it or videotaped it under the illusion that well, he was within 25 feet and he was committing a crime. And then, of course, you know, they get the tape and if it shows anything that's damaging to them, it disappears. Okay, this is a house in run trying to take away the rights of American citizens. And Jason, you should be ashamed of yourself, not upholding the Constitution. We don't need a law making it a crime to photograph public officials or police officers. They already have a law that says a police officer can arrest somebody who interferes with an arrest. If that person's not interfering, he shouldn't be charged with a crime because he's within 25 feet with his camera. If he gets in between the police officer and the other person, well, I understand being arrested. But being 25 feet away, that's the law. Nothing less or you go to jail is nothing but harassment. It would lead to abuse by crooked and corrupt law enforcement officers. How are you going to prove you're 25 feet 1 inch or 24 feet or 23 feet or 30 feet? It'd be all up to the law enforcement officer who makes the allegations to protect himself. Jason, you ought to be ashamed of yourself. You ought to resign from the house. American citizens have to keep the right to maintain, observe, uh, photograph, videotape what public officials are doing. Absolute power is absolute corruption. That's simply it. And worse yet, this bill would make it a crime to have a firearm within 100 feet of a law enforcement officer and take his photograph. Now, does that make sense to you? You may be a lot lawfully carrying a firearm, but if you have a firearm and a camera and take a picture of a cop less than 100 feet, you're committing a crime. This is terrible. This is terrible. Jason, resign. Resign right now. You're a shame to the public. You're not protecting the citizens. A hundred feet away because he's got a right to carry a pistol because he's licensed or happens to have a truck with a, uh, a firearm in it. If I'm stopped and I've got a firearm in my truck, I'm less than a hundred feet away and I take a picture of the cop, I have then committed a crime. Does that make sense, people? Stand up for your constitutional rights. The right to photograph and videotape in public should be absolute. The right to photograph and videotape public officials should be absolute. We don't need another law. If that person gets right in between the officer and the person he's arresting, he's got a law called interference. And they don't need an additional law. That law is enough. This is Master You standing up for you. Stand up for yourself or you won't have anything to stand up for.